Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you work with an accountant who uses the QuickBooks for Accountants edition, you can use the file transferability within QuickBooks Pro to send an accountant's copy to your accountant. To use this feature, you must be using QuickBooks Pro 2013 or better, have an internet connection and an email address, and you must know your accountant's email address. This feature allows you to save the accountant's copy to an Intuit web server, which notifies your accountant via email to download the copy. To perform this task, select File from the menu bar, roll down to Accountant's Copy, and then choose the Send to Accountant command. In the Send Accountant's Copy window that appears, click the Next button to continue. In the next screen, use the Dividing Date drop-down to select a dividing date for your accountant's copy file. The dividing date is the date before which your accountant can make changes, but you cannot. After selecting a dividing date, click the Next button to continue. In the next screen, enter your accountant's email address into the accountant's email address and re-enter the accountant's email address fields. Then enter your name into the your name field and your email address into the your email address field. Then click the next button to continue. In the next screen you can enter a password for the accountant's copy that is stored on the web server. Your accountant will need this password in order to access your accountant's copy. You can enter the same password that you use for the admin account within your company file if desired. You can also enter your own strong password into the Password and Re-Enter Password fields. A strong password is at least seven characters long with at least one capital letter and one digit. Note that you must let your accountant know what the password is so that they can download your company file. You can then enter any additional instructions for your accountant into the note field. Then click the send button to create and upload your accountant's copy to the web server and be sure to let your accountant know what the password is. Your accountant will receive an email with a link that they can click in order to download and open your accountant's copy. Note that they will need to enter the password you created in order to do this. Also, your original company file will display text that says Accountants Changes Pending within its title bar. After creating the accountant's copy, you can still perform normal data entry in the original company file, but note that you cannot make some kinds of changes to the company file, such as deleting, renaming, or structurally rearranging the existing accounts in the chart of accounts. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.